Hey, what's up guys? It's Gathalion and welcome back to Destiny. Today I want to talk to you about the importance of blue items, rare quality gear, and their life cycle inside the game. Uh, this is going to be a highly opinionated video, so if you disagree with me, which I'm sure some of you will, maybe we can have an intelligent conversation about it rather than you saying, shut the fuck up, you don't know shit, you garbage, eat a knife. Anyways, so I believe full-heartedly that blue items and blue gear and rare gear and blah -de blah and what I consider to be the dungeon set uh, do not have as much weight and worth in Destiny's universe as they should. In other loot-based games, blue items can even carry on to endgame and still be good. Uh, continuing on with this theme, purple items or legendaries to us tend to be a lot rarer and what is heavily sought after. Uh, it's my belief that there should be a strike set slash early PvP set that you get from Basic Crucible and from Strikes as in a full set of gear that is very, very good and will be usable through whatever the current raids are if we continue on this path of Strikes to raids to hard raids or whatever. I think the first legendaries that you get should be from extremely difficult quest lines, the raid, Iron Banner and Trials of Osiris and whatever its equivalent moving forward in Destiny is. I think Blue Gear definitely needs to feel more worthwhile. And there's nothing wrong with having a very solid dungeon set. That being said, I also believe that vendor gear is way too strong. In fact, some vendor gear is so good that it makes raid gear look worse in comparison. Most of the raid weapons outside of, say, the LMG can be out outstrengthed or outfought or whatever, outdone by a really well-rolled vendor gear piece of weapon. I don't think the vendor gear should be so easy to acquire if it's going to be on that strength level, and I don't think it should be so good that it outshines or even competes with Iron Banner gear or raid gear. This really makes the endgame raid gear feel less worthwhile but back about what i was saying about the dungeon set there should be a full armor set and some great weapons that are blue quality that you get out of the uh the strikes or dungeons and also out of basic pvp i also believe that there should be full set bonuses both in dungeon set and inside of raid set to make it worthwhile to wear a whole set because currently there's no reason to not wear at least one exotic piece of armor i feel like there should be a trade-off for that. If I have all pieces of the raid set, I should get some sort of bonus on my character for having two, three, and four pieces. So when I choose to use an exotic, I'm trading off some perk for that perk. So that's my feeling on the current progression of gear. Blue needs to last a little bit longer. Leveling up should last a little bit longer as well. And the raid set and Iron Banner and Trials set should be lifted above whatever the equivalent is of a vendor purple. How do you guys feel about this? Jot down some thoughts in the comment section below and we'll get at it. I'll see you guys later.